Well, a dog's life is now on the line tonight in Dearborn County. That's right near Cincinnati. Its owner passed away, and while some people make provisions in their wills for their pets to outlive them, the future of this animal is far less certain. Inside this animal shelter in Lawrenceburg is a German shepherd named Bela. We weren't allowed to see him today, but we're assured he's okay for now. But his fate remains unclear. I have a client, uh, Connie Lay, for whom I prepared the last will and testament, and she made provisions in her will that either the dog uh, be placed with uh, best friends animal side in Utah or otherwise be put to sleep. With Bela's ashes combined with the ashes of his owner, Connie Lay, her attorney says... Lay felt her dog was too vicious to be adopted out. Dogs can be rescued and retrained. Amanda Martin works at the Planet Pet in Lawrenceburg with her trusty sidekick, Skye. Most people look at the dogs as their kids. That's their family. She knows there are a lot of factors to consider when it comes to what's next for Lay's German Shepherd, but it's clear she's on the dog side. If the dog is healthy and if the animal has that bond with you, why would you want to take its life for selfish reasons? The case involving Bela, who's believed to be eight or nine years old, is more cut and dried for Doug Demure. He's an attorney, and he's focused on honoring his client's final wishes. Animals are considered the property of the owner, and that's an asset of the estate that has to be taken care of according to my client's wishes. Now, we reached out to the rescue group in Utah mentioned by the woman's attorney. And as of 4 p.m., they said they have not been contacted about caring for the dog. A close friend will get to make the final decision in this case, and that person is still trying to figure out exactly what the woman really wanted for her dog.